Hello everyone. I am Zahid Abbas. In this video, we are going to learn about the following learning outcomes. Number one, volumes of cylinder, sphere, and cone. Number two, their formulae. And number three, comparison between their volumes. Let's start today's topic. We shall find and compare the volumes of these three three D figures. Number one, cylinder. Number two, sphere. And number three, cone. Let's start with the cylinder first. Suppose radius of the base of this cylinder is R units. Suppose height of this cylinder is H units. We can find the volume of any cylinder using formula volume of cylinder is equal to area of base times height. Note that base of the cylinder is, R, uh, is always circular and area of circle is equal to pi r squared. Hence, volume of cylinder will be equal to pi r squared times h. <clears throat> we can simply write it as volume of this cylinder is equal to pi r squared h. Now suppose height of the cylinder h is equal to twice the radius that is h is equal to 2r then volume of cylinder is equal to pi r squared times 2r and finally it will get the shape 2 pi r cubed Let's try to find the volume of the sphere now. Suppose radius of the sphere is R units. We can find the volume of any sphere using formula. Volume of sphere is equal to 4 by 3 times pi times radius cubed. Hence volume of this sphere will be equal to 4 by 3 times pi times r cubed. Let's try to find the volume of the cone now. Suppose radius of the cone is r units. Suppose height of the cone is h units. We can find the volume of any cone using formula volume of cone is equal to 1 by 3 times area of base times height. Note that base of the cone is again circular in shape and its area will be equal to pi r squared. Hence volume of cone is equal to 1 by 3 times pi r squared times h. Suppose height of the cone h is equal to 2r. Then volume of cone is 1 by 3 times pi r squared times 2r. So volume of cone will be equal to 2 by 3 pi r cubed. Comparison between volumes of cylinder, sphere and cone. Cylinder versus sphere. Volume of cylinder is equal to 2 pi r cubed and volume of sphere is equal to 4 by 3 pi r cubed. Using formula of volume of sphere, volume of the sphere is equal to 4 by 3 pi r cubed. 
we can write it as volume of the sphere is equal to 2 by 3 into 2 pi r cubed. Hence, volume of the sphere will be equal to 2 by 3 times volume of cylinder as formula of volume of cylinder is equal to 2 pi r cubed. It means volume of the sphere is two third times the volume of cylinder. Cylinder versus cone. Volume of cylinder is equal to 2 pi r cubed and volume of cone is equal to 2 by 3 pi r cubed. We use the formula of volume of cone. Volume of the cone is equal to 2 by 3 pi r cubed. We can write it as volume of the cone is equal to 1 by 3 into 2 pi r cubed and volume of the cone will be equal to 1 by 3 times volume of cylinder because 2 pi r cubed is the volume of cylinder. Hence, volume of the cone is one third the volume of cylinder. Sphere versus cone. Volume of sphere is equal to 4 by 3 pi r cubed and volume of cone is equal to 2 by 3 pi r cubed. Once again, choose the formula of volume of the cone which is equal to 2 by 3 pi r cubed. We can write it as 1 by 2 into 4 by 3 pi r cubed. So volume of the cone will be equal to 1 by 2 into volume of sphere as 4 by 3 pi r cubed is the volume of the sphere. Hence, volume of the cone is half of the volume of the sphere. Deduction Volume of cylinder is equal to the sum of volumes of sphere and cone. Cylinder is equal to sphere plus cone. Volume of cylinder is equal to volume of sphere plus volume of cone. Volume of cylinder is equal to 4 by 3 pi r cubed plus 2 by 3 pi r cubed. As 4 by 3 pi r cubed is the formula of volume of sphere and 2 by 3 pi r cubed is the volume of cone. Volume of cylinder will be equal to 4 by 3 plus 2 by 3 times pi r cubed. And so volume of the cylinder will be equal to 6 by 3 pi r cubed and it will be equal to 2 pi r cubed which is the which is the formula of volume of cylinder. Hence it is proved that volume of cylinder is equal to volume of sphere plus volume of cone provided uh, their radius are same and height is equal to twice the radius.